guys! So today is December 12. So Vlogmas Day 12. And magagawa tayo ng candles. DIY candle. And meron akong special guest! Hello! Hello! Si Jerby! Ayan. Nag-YouTube din siya guys. So if you're interested sa mga essential oils and stuff. Ayan. Ikaw na magsabi sis. Hello! So ayan. I'm inviting everyone to check me out. It's Couch Wasabi on YouTube. Mm -hmm. Tapos I do a lot of workshops. So it's also there. Mm -mm. So don't forget to Ilalagay check me out. Ilalagay ko na lang yung mga links niya sa description box. Tapos meron ka din yung sa mga workshop mo yung sa Instagram. Yung yes. official Instagram and Page, yes, so diba? that's Happy Oiler PH. Mm -mm. So we'll link everything down. Ayon. So ano yung anong ba natin? Gagawin natin today. All right. So today I will share with you how to make your own natural scented candles. Because if mm -hmm. you don't, mahilig ka sa candle, right? Oh, oh. Okay. <laughs> okay. So I'm sure you've bought a lot of candles from your regular store, and usually yung mga candles nyan are made from paraffin wax. Mm. Okay, so when you burn those candles, yung mga regular candle na binibili mo outside, mm -mm. it's normally made from paraffin. Therefore, whenever you burn it, meron mga petrochemical na nare-release. Oh my gosh, may mga ganun pa pala yun. Correct, girl. <laughs> Plus, on top of the wax, kasi mm -hmm. yan yung wax na pinag-uusapan natin. On top of it, yung mga, yung amoy na na-appreciate mo at sobrang bango, those are actually synthetic. Ah, okay. Okay, so today we are gonna... Try to remove that from your life. Mm -mm. That you will be able to create now on your own mm -mm. using natural ingredients. Mm -mm. Tapos today we will be using pure essential oils to scent your candle. All right. So today we will be teaching you also how to make something like this. I so this is that. like a candle bouquet na natural mm -hmm. candle scented with essential oils plus dried flowers. Oh oh, tis ang ganda na din yung pang display. Correct. So pag ginanyan mo, ayan. ayan. Uh, so, check us out, Katy Corn Dreams. Yes. <laughs> Home of the lush type shampoo bars. <laughs> so, Jerby, ano yung kailangan natin na material? Alright, so for today, you will definitely need your candle holder. Mm -hmm. Any kind ng gusto yeah. nila. Okay. I like this better. I get this from Landers. Mm. Um, How much yung isang ganito? Girl, murang-mura lang. Para 100 plus lang to, tatlo ah, na. Okay. <laughs> but it's small. Okay, so you can get others, other candle mm -hmm. holders na mas malaki, meron sa Gordos. Um, what I like about this is that makapal siya. Uh oh oh. So when you're trying to make your own candles, alam ko marami ngayong mga nagbebenta ng homemade candles. And when I go around, nakikita ko kasi yung gamit nila parang yung mga jar. Mm -hmm. Ang problema ko dun, masyadong manipis yun. Uh oh oh, so pag uminat na uminat? Baka sumabog. Ah, okay. okay. <laughs> So, you know, you have to be very careful and think of the safety. Mm -hmm. So, I like buying this from Landers. Not, not that expensive. Mm -hmm. um, and makapal. So, it's a nice tempered glass na parang kung kasing kapal na niya yung mga oh, pirates. Oh, 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 so, no. even if super init, you're not scared of kung sasabog siya. Kahit. Our candle base will be beeswax. So, mm -hmm. this is just pure white beeswax. Mm -hmm. I like working with white beeswax pellets kasi but if you decide to color it, mm -hmm. diba later you want to color yours. Mm -hmm. So you decide to color it, hindi siya mag-hinder. Kasi pag yellow yung ginamit mo, pag hinalo mo naman yung pink, magiging orange. Hindi siya maganda. Ah, okay. So for you to be able to reflect the color that you want, stay with the white beeswax palette. Okay. Um, saan kaya nila if ever dito sa Philippines makabili ng Meron si Cedar Alley. Ah, okay. Cedar. So link ko na lang din guys Correct. sa description. Okay? okay. And then you'll also need BCO. Ah, okay. Yung the normal lang na BCO. Oh, any. any. Ah, okay. From the grocery. Plus, to decorate your candle, to mm -hmm. color it, I like using mica coloring. Mica? Oh, ayoko yung mga food coloring. Ayoko, mm -hmm. ayoko talaga. Anong difference nito sa normal na food coloring? Correct. Kasi these are natural colorants. These mm -hmm. are actually minerals. Ito rin yung ginagamit sa um, eyeshadow mineral makeup. Mm -hmm. Oh, oh. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> Correct. So these are my coloring. Mm -hmm. Marami na nito ngayon sa Shopee. It's not Shopee. as hard to get as before. Before we import everything. Mm -hmm. But now meron na to sa Shopee. So pwede niyo bilhin for 10 gram, 20 gram, mm -hmm. You can also use glitters. Ah, just in case siya, you want. Hindi naman siya parang pag na burn. Ay, something. hindi naman. Ah. Kasi these are fine cosmetic glitter. Lavender buds are dried botanicals for you to adorn your candle, like mm -hmm. what we showed earlier. Mm -hmm. Para mag enjoy the kaka design. Mm -hmm. And then you need also your con contactless thermometer. Ah, uh, then. <coughs> Wala pag wala sa lang ganto. <laughs> oh, para. Okay, kasi I like measuring 
the wax before pouring it sa lalagyan kasi mm -hmm. Um, it helps prevent yung paglubog sa gitna, yung indention sa gitna. Mm. Wala na ako sample ngayon eh. Pero, um, if you attend any of my other classes, or if I upload my ano, hindi ko pa yata na-upload yung ano ko, <laughs> isang workshop ko, nakikita doon yung ibang students, pag masyado nilang mainit, pinor sa lalagyan, uh -oh. lulubog yung gitna niya. It's not that nice. Mm. So, we monitor it later with this thermometer. Okay. Um, you can also use yung parang pangluto, yung may stick. Uh oh, pwede lang, din yun. Kasi hirap kasi yun. Uh oh. Kasi didikit pa yung wax nung sa ano. Ito, magkakalat pa Correct. Siya. So, mm -hmm. ito na lang. Mura lang ito. Of course, you will need your wigs. Ayan. Ngayon, sobrang easy na. Before, I used to um, buy separate strings. Oops. Oops. Okay lang. <laughs> I used to buy separate strings and separate producers. Tapos ako pa yung nagkakabit. Ngayon, may mabibili ka na na naka-instant na, kumbaga. Mm -hmm. Pwede mo nalang idikit diretso. Okay. So, ito yung candle wick mo. I like choosing cotton wick para mas malinis yung burn. Mm -hmm. And I like yung pre-wax na para nakatayo na siya. Oo nga. One special trick also is I also have these um, candle wick holders. Oo. Yan. Para, kasi others would normally use chopsticks or pencils para mm. to keep the wicks in place. May nabibili na naman ganito. Uh -oh, so, <laughs> so, you know, take use of those modern tools that we have. Mm -hmm. Okay? So, we can start na? Okay, go! Okay. First, you get your wick. Mm -hmm. Ikaw magano. Tapos, idibikit natin siya sa candle holder. Yan yung first step. Ah, dito. Correct. So, I like using double-sided tape. Mm -hmm. Pero, you can also use glue gun. Mas mabili siguro yun. Mm -hmm. Pero, mas gusto ko na rin. Ikat mo lang sa ilalim. Tapos, peel it off and then, dikit mo sa gitna ng candle holder. Ah, okay. Lagyan mo lang sa mm. gitna. Tapos, pindot-pindotin mo lang siya. Okay. Okay na ba? Okay, good. And then, you use this. Yan. This is what I like about the candle wick holder. Kasi, yan, isisilid mo lang dun sa maliit na space. Mm -mm. Yan. Oo oh, nga, tapos may iba-iba siyang sizes. Yes, to fit your candle holder. Oo, oh, okay. Yeah. Okay, very good. So, you set it aside. Mm -hmm. And then let's measure our ingredients. So today we are using yung beeswax. Yung mm -hmm. okay. One third lang. One third ba ito? So this is one fourth. One fourth cup of beeswax. How would you know kung gaano kadami kailangan mo for this size? Na? Correct. Okay, The norm normally I do. Ito yung kukunin ko. Ito yung papandakot ko dun sa beeswax. Mm, oo nga. So puno siya. Pero pag binurn mo yan later, merong maliit na space. Which is just perfect for the lalagyan. Oo. Oh, oh. mm -hmm. So since ito, medyo gamay ko na siya. Alam mm -hmm. ko na one fourth kayo niya yun. Mm -hmm. Oo. Oh. Okay, <laughs> Nakatawa ito parang beads. Correct. It's actually <laughs> called beeswax pellets. And uh -oh. you buy that. Ah. Huwag kayong bibili ng beeswax na bloke. Eh, uh -oh. Kasi medyo mahirap yung tanawin. Pag so, beeswax pellets, mm, that's the best. Okay. Ayan. Tsaka parang mas madali siyang i-measure. Correct. Tapos lagay ko na. Yes. Ay, para lang ako gluto. Sorry. <laughs> okay, tapos, you can put one teaspoon of your VCO. Okay. One teaspoon. Mm -mm. So, bakit one teaspoon? Kasi maliit lang siya. Pero mm. if you... Tsaka, anong para saan yung VCO? but kailangan ng VCO? Good question. Kasi mm. normally, people, when they make their, for example, beeswax, Hindi na nila nilalagyan ng BCO. Ang result oh. nun, nagkakatunnel yung candle. Yung hindi even yung burn niya. Mm. Yung parang sa may wick lang yung natutunaw ng natutunaw. Oo, oh, tapos na iiwan na yung hindi. Correct. Sa side. Oo. Oh, oh. Tumangit. Um, Ginagawa ko pag ganun, parang, alam mo yung ni-scrape mo. Oo, oh, kung natutunaw. Nakayo din mo. Oo, oh, parang di sayo. Hassle, di ba? Oo. Oh, oh. So, you add beeswax. You, um, you add BCO to ha to make your candles burn even. You can add a little more. Para Ay, sa pa. Kung feel mo, ganyan. <laughs> mm, yun yung pinaka, ano niya. Yun yung parang secret niya. niya. Ah, okay. It helps your wax to melt more evenly. Okay. So, BCO lang talaga. Hindi pwede ibang oils. Ideally, BCO. Kasi BCO has a high flash point. Ano yun? Compared to other oils. <laughs> Ibig sabihin, yung BCO, mas na... Mas... Hindi siya na degrade sa high heat. Mm, okay, so iba. kahit ma-burn siya. Correct. Kasi okay. iba-ibang oils, iba-iba sila ng flash point. Meaning yung flash point, yun yung temperature niya na pag the meat na yun, ma-degrade na yung oil, iba na yung chemical composition. Mm, okay. okay. So for example, um, grapeseed oil has low flash point. Mabilis yan maanta. Oo. Oh, oh. Konting init lang, naanta na siya. So ayan yung mga ganun oil. 
So we stay away from grapeseed oil. I guess um, sweet almond is also not okay. Mm -hmm. Extra virgin olive oil, bawal initin, remember? Mm -hmm. So yung mga you stay away from those. Use na lang BCO. It's one of the safest kasi mataas yung flash point niya. Okay, and dami ko natututunan sa kanya guys. Mas yung workshop niya. Okay. Okay. okay, so this one, we're ready to melt this na. Mm -hmm. So let's go to the microwave. Okay, ah, so microwave siya. Okay, okay so as I said earlier, mm -hmm. take to 30 minutes lang yung pasok mo yung burn 30 seconds. Ay, sorry, take to 30 seconds lang yung pasok mo and burn mo ng beeswax. Kasi, uh -oh. pag pinasok mo siya ng isang isahan. Oh, like 3 minutes agad. Correct. Yung, yung microwave mo kasi, it works by heating one spot in your lalagyan. Mm -mm. Okay? So, magiging overheated yung isang spot. Oh, so, masisira okay. siya. Okay. Ganun magiging sa microwave. Kaya dapat, every 30 seconds, nilalabas mo siya. Okay, sorry. Okay. Tapos, irarun mo siya ulit. Be careful okay. lah, kasi um, the longer it's in, medyo mas mainit yung glass. So, you may need your pot holder. Okay. Huwag nyo lang basta basta hahawakan. Mm. So, nakita mo, most of it are melted na. So, pasok lang natin. Siguro mga dalawa pa. Oh, tapos, okay. ready na ito. You can oh, also stir it. Dapat walang bubo. No? Correct. Walang bubo. Pwede mo rin siyang stir. Ay, pa, oh, mas may natutunaw. Natutunaw din naman siya. Mm -hmm. Yan. So, you can stop at this point. Na stir mo na lang. Or you oh, can oh. pop it in for two more rounds. It's also fine. Mm -hmm. And then, we can proceed na. Okay. Ayan, sobrang melted na siya. Correct. So, it's evenly melted now. Mm -hmm. Hindi mo po pwedeng idagdag yung EO mo at this point. Kasi it's so hot pa. Mm -hmm. Remember, ang kalaban ng essential oils is heat and sunlight. Oh, and this oh, is so ano. hot, so hindi mo pwedeng ilagay yung EO. Dito pa pasok yung contactless thermometer mo. Okay. So, i-measure mo siya. Okay. Mm, ayaw niya pa. It's too high. Mm. So ideally, you want to put in your oils at 50 degrees Celsius. Okay. Okay? So I think that's about 160 to 65 Fahrenheit naman. Okay. Alright, so habang everything is still melted and liquefied, it's mm. best to put in your mica. Okay. So, so put lang siguro 1 4 teaspoon. Medyo dark to eh, pag 1 4. So half lang siguro, 1 ah, 8 okay. teaspoon. Kasi with mica, you only need a little to color it. Ganyan? Pwede na ba? Yes, pwede na yan. Okay. Ayan. Haluin mo lang siya really, really well. Ayan. Medyo mainit nga yung handle. So, oh, get oh, your mainit siya. holder. Ayan. Until it's fully melted. Ang nice, no? Mm -hmm. Para siyang metallic na oh, oh. galaxy na something like that. Ang bango. That's the smell of your natural beeswax. Mm -hmm. Kasi kapag hindi siya fully melted, pag hindi siya naayos na, nahalo ng maayos, mm -hmm. ganito ang itsura. Mm -hmm. Ayan, mag so, may, oh, may iwan siya sa ilagyan. Mm -hmm. So, it's important na habang mainit pa siya and liquefied and well melted, ilagay mo na yung mica coloring. Yeah. Tapos, i-mix mo ng maayos. Ayaw pa din. Ayaw pa siya. Mm -hmm. So, matagal-tagal to. <laughs> Ito talaga yung inaantay. Okay. And after this, it's easy na moving uh -oh. forward. Mm. You can use beeswax. It's very beneficial for you. Mm, okay. It helps less the air. Na, so, diba so, ngayon na naamoy mo yung amoy niya, oh, diba? Oo, tapos inaamoy ko nga. Uh -oh. Wala pang EO yan. Oo, oh, oh, tapos, tapos, tapos ano, yan. ang amoy ko sa kanya, may kasi ako sa tinamoy ko, feeling ko nasa panaderi ako. <laughs> diba? It smells clean eh. Oo. Oh, oh. oh, so, yun. It helps less the air. So, I really like using. This uh -oh. is also what we use in Catecholin. Si soy wax. Okay siya, kasi si soy, wala siyang petrochemical na nare-release kapag you burn it. That's why people also use it. Mm -mm. Kasi may nakita ko minsan, uh, may nagregalo ko sa akin last time, soy candle sa No, oh, that's nice. That's ah, okay. nice. Rather than buying yung mga regular scented candles, kasi yung mga regular scented candle, yun yung mga may petrochemical. Ibig sabihin, gawa yun sa uh, petroleum base. Mm. And kapag nasunog kasi yun, yung usually makikita mo, di ba, parang may black na usok? Oo. Oh, oh. Yan yung bad. That's actually oh. carcinogenic. Okay, yun po man din yung sa CR ko. Sabi ko, ano ba yun? Ano na, yung black na black na yung gilid. Correct. Naku, bad yan. Those are soot. S-O-O-T. Soot. Oh. Carcinogenic yan. Pag na-inhale mo yan, it accumulates in your body, in your lymph node. Okay. Yeah, I will share with you a little story. Okay. Nung bata rin ako, nung high school ako, I really okay. love using scented candles. In fact, hindi ako nag-aaral noon sa pag wala akong scented candle. Oo, oh, oh, diba? Bili ko niya ako makakoncentrate. Pag nag-arte oh, oh. ako in life. Oh, oh. <laughs> so, that was the entire high school. And then, in college, I got into this parang holistic clinic. Mm -mm. 
So, may hinawakan akong parang device, tapos parang chuchuchut lalabas dun sa computer screen ng doktor. Uh -oh. So, sa computer screen niya, meron yung parang katawan ng tao, tapos lalabas yung how many, yung parang toxic. Uh -oh, kung ano yung toxin mo. mo sa katawan. Mm -mm. So, yung banda dito, kung may color black, the darker it is, the more toxic you have in your body. Parang ganun. Uh -oh. So, may black daw yung dito ko. Sabi ko sa doctor, ano yan? Bakit uh -oh. may ganyan? Mm -mm. Kasi all the others were yellow and red. So, it mm -mm. was te technically fine. Mm -mm. Only on this part. Sabi ko, ano yan? Sabi niya, ang first na tinanong ng doctor sa akin, do you use a lot of scented candles? Oh. oh! Oh my gosh! Sabi ko, I was shook kasi sabi ko, first time ko siya. Kung ano na ako, first time ko lang na ito. Totoo niya alam. Oh, oh. Ito bakit? Anong meron? Sabi niya kasi, yung mga scented candle, yung mga, pag nababurn siya, yun nga, yung mga black na uso. Oo. Oh, oh. Pag na-inhale mo yan, nag-accumulate yan sa lymph node mo. We have lymphatic drainage here, di ba? Oh, Parang dito, tapos oh, oh. bababa dito sa may kilikili. Mm -hmm. So, doon nag-reflect na marami na akong toxic deposits on my body. Oh my goodness. Since then, hindi na ako ng scented candle. So I stop na. Um, luckily, naman we, our bodies have this natural excretory function. We eliminate naman some of the toxins over time. Mm -hmm. So matagal na yun, I, I hope. Oh, na, 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 na sa ko. Oh, okay. <laughs> but for all of you guys, please stop na using scented candles. Maybe you can resort to soy candle. Uso na rin siya ngayon. It's not hard to find those, mm -hmm. diba? Soy candle or beeswax candles. Those mm -hmm. are more. Uh, those are healthier options for you. Mm -mm. Or, check out nyo yung bago ni Cathy Corn. Oh. <laughs> na, hindi pa niya na-release. Hindi pa. Oh, Soon. It's ready-made, but we posted, I think, a couple of days back. Uh -oh. Uh -oh. Pero it's gonna be part of the holiday set this month, and then next year na namin siya mababenta individually. Mm -hmm. Ayan. Yeah. So, it's 55. So 55. It's safe na to put in your oil. So, today, okay. we will be using... Lavender, Lavender uh, the sweet, sweet orange, orange, and peppermint. Tama. Chinek pa namin kasi meron na kong dog si Chu Chai. Chu Chai. Na kapuha si ako sa vlogs ko. Inabongan nila si Chu Chai. Ako nyan. So kung saan dalhin mo si Chu Chai today? Ah, dapat sa anak kasi sabi ko na kung may iwan ko na may anak ko. Kasi may mga building kasi bawal aso. So drop in your oils. Ilang drops ng peppermint. Okay, so you need twenty, twenty, twenty. Ah, twenty. Yes. Okay, so yun. Twenty. Twenty. Okay. Kung ganon kaya ako hindi babayaran na. Kinahalo ko habang ikaw magdrop. Para mamit siya ng evenly sa wax. So twenty den to. Correct. Okay. 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 Kasi pag hindi mo siya hinalo ng ayos din mo. Um, nasa taas lang si oil. Ah okay. So you have to make sure na hinahalo siya habang nagalaga. Oh. Okay. Very good. Ayan. Tapos mix lang ng maigit. Oh, mix mo lang siya bago mo i-pour sa lalagyan. Ayan. Okay na, di ba? Wala na nakahiwalay? Mm -mm. Okay, good. So, we can Ayan. start pouring it down. Sige. Ikaw na yung mag-pour. Okay. <laughs> Ayan. Ooh, ang ganda. Baby pink. point, you just repeat the steps mm -hmm. para dun sa green. Para maging layered candle siya. Okay. And then, Genzel adorned it with botanicals like roses and lavenders. Oo. Uh -oh. Ito yung nilagay natin kanina. Correct. I think ganito, no? Correct. Ayan. So, ikakot off lang natin yung excess wick. And mm. then, pwede mo na siyang tanggalin. Yung... Tada! Ang cute! Para nagmatch din pala na green yung ano, para nag-stand out yung Yes, you're wearing your purple. Tapos ito, tapos na ito. Tapos na! Wow! Yan na siya! That's your customized scented candle. Proudly made by Jenza. Ayan. So that's it guys for our DIY candle. Ayan, scented candle. Thank you so much, Derby. Ayan guys. So if meron pa kayo mga ibang gustong sanihan na workshop, meron si Derby. I-check nyo na lang yung mga links na ilalagay ko sa description box. And don't forget to follow also Kati Kati Carly. Meron silang shampoo bar. So ano ba yung specialty nung... Siyempre, ang dami nga, di ba sabi ko sa'yo kanina, ang dami yung nagkalat na mga shampoo bars na nabibili nyo sa market ngayon. So, ano yung for you is bakit magsa-stand out si Kate Corn Dream Shampoo? Yes, pang Miss Universe! Okay, so, 
We are the first shampoo bar here in the Philippines that mm -hmm. you can call as Lush 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 Dupe. Mm -hmm. <laughs> it's a bean. It's so close, like your Lush shampoo bar, which is mm -hmm. the OG shampoo bar. Mm -hmm. Karami kasi ng mga shampoo bar na binibenta ngayon in the Philippines, in the bazaars. Mm -hmm. Mas lalo na yung mga masyadong mura. Oh, Those oh. are actually soaps. Mm -hmm. And marketed or sold as shampoo bars. Ang paggawa ng sabon ay totally different from paggawa ng shampoo bars. Mm -hmm. In fact, up to the pH level, may mga ganun factor oh, pa. Oh. Yung pH level ng sabon is highly alkaline or highly basic. Mm -hmm. Kaya kung napansin nyo, pag bumili kayo ng mga mura na shampoo bar, pag ginamit mo, Either sobrang tigas ng buhok, mm -hmm. or yun nga yung naglalagas. Kasi diba pag gumamit ka ng regular soap on your hair, ganun yung effect. Uh -oh. Kaya yun din yung effect ng shampoo bar na nabili mong mura kasi those are basically sabon. Mm -hmm. The real shampoo bar like Lush uses 90% surfactant. Mm -hmm. So si Lush ang ginagamit niya, SLS, mm -hmm. totally fine. It's a common surfactant. That's mm -hmm. the cheapest surfactant. But what's different about Catty is we use milder cocoa-based mm -hmm. surfactant. Which is baby foam or SEI, gentle enough for babies. Ah, okay. We use SCS and we use natural ingredients. Well, not preservative at all. Wow. Everything in here is shelf stable. It can last you for about two years. Ay, nang di, like, hindi pa nang open. Hindi oh. Oh, but each bar is, you can use this for more than three months. Mm, oh, so, so that's about, it. yeah, 100 washes plus plus. Yung akin, August ko ginamit, may buhay pa siya. November, December na. Four months na. Okay. <laughs> so, sobra sulit siya. Tsaka matipid pa. Tapos healthy pa siya for the hair. And the environment. Oh, yes. yeah. Yeah. <laughs> wait. So, yung kunyari pati yung sa paper din, di ba? Yeah. Oh, no. Yeah. Galing. That's why we try to use minimal packaging. Mm -hmm. Kasi nga, we try to reduce. It's not, right now, our generation, it's not enough na to recycle. Mm -mm. We should prioritize reducing. Mm -mm. Diba? So, with one shampoo bar, you eliminate three bottles of shampoo na kailangan mong itapon. Wow. If you use this in your travel, you eliminate yung mga sachet na kailangan mong itapon. Oh, oh. Diba? It's super helpful. Mm -mm. And we are available in Gordos, so we're everywhere. Mm -hmm. And then, you also have a retailer in Cebu, and hopefully also in Davao very soon. But so, online, pa, you, you also have like so Shopee. Yes, there is a Shopee, and then there is an IG. You can order directly through our IG, sa Catycorn Dreams. Mm -hmm. Yeah, better into on. Ayon. So ang hawak ko ngayon ay anong ano nito? Oh, Lavender? this is Secret Garden. Ah, Secret oh. Garden. <laughs> ah, ito pala okay. Ito pala yung minyo. So Secret Garden is a beautiful mix of pomegranate, apple blossom, ilang ilang, wow. and this one has argan oil. So this is good for anong di ba meron din ba siya parang for iba ibang yes. hair types? So this yeah. is what this one is for dry hair. Mm -hmm. So medyo dry and lifeless. Use this because it's really moisturizing. Mm -hmm. Yeah, because meron nga siyang argan oil and shea butter. Mm -hmm. Okay. Mm -hmm. Tapos how so, mo is. This one naman is patok sa mga bagets. Um, okay. <laughs> this is strawberry lemonade. Cakay okay, yung bubble gum namin. Yun yung mabenta sa mga kids. Because mm -hmm. ay so pwede nga pala pwede siya sa kids. Sa mga ina ana. So pamangkin. Yan pwede to. Uh -oh. Um favorite nila ito. Um, kasi ang bango niya, it smells so fun. Ay, oo. Oh, oh. Diba? Oh. Sabi nga ni Julia, bless my bag, mm -hmm. sabi nga niya, parang amoy Kool-Aid daw. Oo. Oh, oh. True. <laughs> uh, ito naman for? This one naman, it has aloe extra. So, it's great for nice, youthful, and bouncy hair. Mm, yeah. Okay. So, ilang yung variants nyo? Oh, for fine hair. Fine and limp hair din. Okay. Oh, so, meron pa kay orange siya ka. Yes, so, we have seven variants. Ah, and dami pala. Oh, girl. Ayan. So, check. <laughs> kailangan i-check nyo talaga yung page nila. Correct. Ayan. And you also launch, di ba, soon yung mga candles. Yes. Yeah, so, yeah. our candle bouquets, as we call it, will be launched maybe next year na, but it's already mm. available this year sa Shopee for pre-order. Okay. And then okay. it's also available in our holiday kits. Ayan. Yeah, so thank you so much guys for watching and don't forget to also subscribe to Jerby. Thank She's you. uploading videos, di ba? Ang nakatawa kasi parang um, you, you, you don't only share it with your workshop, nag upload ka din na mga videos. So for those na um, malalayo, okay, you can just subscribe to her channel. I'll link it in below. So yun lang sana nag enjoy ka din dito. Sana nag enjoy. Oh, pero sobrang enjoy ako guys, grabe. And marami kayong matututunan sa kanya. Ayun lang. So thank you so much guys for watching. Please don't forget to subscribe and I will see you tomorrow. Bye.